Hi everyone and welcome back to the current household series. I almost forgot which series I was recording for. But uh, yeah, so we're here at current household. Now looking at this, you guys would probably think, oh, you know, the timeline isn't that big or anything. But let's just jump up to Sarah, who was our original heir. And yeah, the family tree doesn't even fit anymore. And what really sucks is that I wish you could zoom in and out so that all of this could be viewed at once. But um, yeah, unfortunately, we can't do that. So uh, so we're, if we go down the line, Sarah, Naomi, Jacqueline, Laura, Atlanta, and now if I can find her, there she is. Roxanne. Ah, <laughs> Roxana. But uh, so that's the main family. But as you guys can see, the family tree is quite large. And this is stuff that's only happened since the uh, recent update for The Sims, uh, where uh, households that have not been played in will expand on their own. And that's. Uh, well, that's the small problem of it. They expand. And they expand into other houses at full capacity. Uh, so, it's a little uh, little crazy on the uh, family tree. So, I'll just keep it like this for now. Uh, so, we do have Roxanne, and she is recently married to Herman. Uh, something I find really weird is this, like, he has kids, but if I look, to see like who the parents are for these two he doesn't even know them uh, I think that the same thing happened with was it Rex or no no it was um Blake it was with Blake I don't think you guys actually met these two or maybe you did I don't know uh but yeah so with uh, Blake, he had these three kids, and he didn't even know who the mother was. And now the same thing has happened with uh, Roxanne. Uh, Carson, you have a son? Yeah. No, you have a stepson. You don't actually have a son with her yet. Okay, never mind. <laughs> But uh, yeah, so somehow he has two kids. The, the mothers aren't even the same. It, they both have two different mothers. But the thing is that she is started dating him as a teen. And so there's no reason for him to have uh, been with anyone else. So it's really weird glitchy stuff that probably could be fixed. But it's not. So yeah, <laughs> that's just how it is. So... Uh, right now, that is the family tree. Nothing all that interesting has really happened apart from me just trying to age everyone up. Uh, I haven't been playing with this lot as much as I used to. So it actually, I honestly had them married and they recently had their son. And now they're having some more kids. She just got pregnant again. Uh, there it is, new baby. Oh wait, no, where's... There it is, eating for two. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, so that's uh, the family right now. Uh, the main part I want, like, I've been talking about this non-stop for the past few weeks. I know I have, and I kind of just briefly glanced over it. But look at this freaking family tree. Like, I understand family trees are huge. But, like, look at the, this one household. Who is the parent of this one household? I think it's you. Like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten kids. And I don't think any of them have the same uh, mother. So it's just, it's crazy. <laughs> it is really crazy. But I think that's something I love about this. It's like you get these huge family trees and it's just so crazy and I love it. Like, where else but on The Sims could you find something like this? And I'm just in love with how crazy all of this is getting. So, uh, yeah, that's, um, that, it, oh, you know what? I shouldn't message EA about that, or being able to scroll in and out of the, uh, 
family tree, the uh, geno genealogy. And so you can see everything on one uh, one page so without having to like move around and everything. Because that would be awesome. Because like right now I might do the family tree like that. Or I might just jump in and do just this as a family tree. Or I might even... Where is he? Might just do that. Maybe? I don't know. Uh, right now she... She's... Because uh, I don't have another daughter and I like to keep along the daughter line. So I might do that as a family picture. Or I might... I don't know. I don't know what I'll do right now. But... Um, yeah, this... It's just this family tree. And the, this keeps bugging me. I had accidentally uninstalled her hair and then she died before I could fix it. So now she's forever bald. And it's gonna bug me because everyone else, you know, if they had custom hair when they died, you know, they they kept the custom hair. But she's the only one that had custom hair when she died and now the custom hair is gone so she is forever bald. So, yeah. That's uh... I wonder why her, the, their kids aren't showing. That's weird. I just realized that. Uh, but yeah, so what do we got? We're at 13 minutes left. So I've just spent about most of this time just talking about this huge family. I'm sorry, I can't get over this one. The 10 kids. They're all probably with their mothers, which is how... Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I love The Sims. I really do love The Sims because you get things like this. But yeah, so... Uh, this is their current house. Um, I don't think I did a speed build for this one. I think I just was wanted to make something quick and this is what I thought of. So, yeah, this is the, uh, the house. <laughs> quick tour down here. It's the uh, entry. We have a little bit of a study here. Kids room, indoor pool, living room, dining room, kitchen with an Eden. Uh, I think it's uh, called a breakfast nook, I believe that's the actual term for it. Uh, upstairs we have the hallway, fitness room, uh, master because it has an ensuite, bedroom two and bedroom three with an additional uh, two bathrooms. So, oh yeah, and there's a bathroom down here. So there's four? Yeah, I think that's why you just count. Four bathrooms, three bedrooms, lots of space. And of course we have our lovely garden out here in the back. We have a little area for everyone to get married. Yeah, you know, some kids stuff, some eating areas outside. It's a very lovely house. Oh yes, and then we have our tombstones over here. <laughs> um, yeah, that's pretty much it for the house. Uh, as for people, right now we have Rex, who is feeding baby Anthony. I like the name Anthony. <laughs> uh, so we have Rex. Atlanta was the previous heir. Uh, the title now passes on to Roxana who was the only daughter. I don't do any more than three children, so we uh, only had the one daughter because uh, Atlanta had... Oh, who... Oh, I feel bad now. Who are her siblings? Luca and Carson. Of course, I forgot... How could I forget Carson? Oh, I feel bad now. I purposely picked the name Carson because at the time I was watching Stargate Atlantis. And we had just watched the episode Sunday, and in that episode, um, uh, when the character's Carson, he dies, and it's in this heart-wrenching way, and it's just like, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry, and you start crying because Carson was like one of your one of the best characters in the whole, sh well, not in the whole show. I think, oh yeah, I have the whole show. I think Carson was probably one of my favorites. There were a few, like the main team were my favorite, and there was Carson, but yeah, so, <laughs> uh. I named uh, Carson after that, and then I I found I was just going through the names, and Roxana came up, and for some reason I thought it was Roxanne, and so oh she's just announcing that she is pregnant, <laughs> as uh, Roxana came up, and for the longest time I kept calling her Roxanne, like the song from the Police, and oh my god I, I think at one point i was actually going to change her name from roxana to roxanne just because i kept calling her that uh but yeah so honestly look up the song roxanne from the police it's amazing i love that i love a lot of songs from the 70s and 80s like that is the genre i listen to, not genre the 
type of music I listen to the most, like the timeline wise. I don't listen to a lot of modern day stuff. Um, but I do still listen to modern day stuff if you guys haven't been watching some of my previous videos. I am addicted to Melanie Martinez right now. Like, I think I actually just gave someone a, uh, the, oh, it was the, uh, New Cross Legacy Challenge. I gave my girl a makeover and I gave her the Melanie Martinez t-shirt from when she, uh, works out. And you are working out. Oh, let's see what she's, uh, pregnant with. Um, oh. <laughs> Okay, let's see what she's pregnant with. Pregnancy, scan, oh, I have to have it on play. Uh, Roxanne is pregnant, it's a boy. Okay, I've been having this thing where they always have boys, so I might change that later on. I don't know, you guys probably won't know until I do have an heir. <laughs> or, until, you know, this is the August update, so you guys won't know until the end of September. And boy, I hope I have videos, uh, stories for you guys for those videos. Um, and since, uh, I don't know if you guys will watch my new Chris Legacy Challenge or my speed builds, but I will be doing something special for my speed builds come October. So that's a little ways away, but I do have something planned for all of my speed builds then. Just to fit in with the theme of Halloween in October. Halloween is my favorite, so I will definitely be looking forward to that. And speaking of Halloween, because we dress up and everything, uh, this weekend I am going to the um, Fan Expo here in Toronto. Uh, so I'm looking really excited. I'm really excited to that. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, my best friend, uh, she's been my best friend since like grade nine. So you know we're we're really close. Uh, she's uh, this is her first time ever going to a convention. So I'm you know, really excited to uh, drag her along with me. Uh, it's just, you know, conventions are something I've been going to since, you know, I was born. You know, every summer I go to one and I've always wanted her to come with me. So uh, the fact that she gets to come with me to uh, one of these conventions, it's awesome. Uh, personally, the I was looking forward to meeting a lot of people, uh, but one of the persons I wanted to meet, uh, he did unfortunately cancel, so maybe another time. Uh, the other person, it, it's unclear on what he's actually doing, but it's, it seems as though you drop off the object you want him to sign, and then you pick it up later on, and that's not really what, you know, getting autographs is for me. You know, autographs is going up to actually meet the person. So, uh, it was, you know, kind of bummer when I read that. That's what it seems to be. Uh, so I was kind of disappointed, but... Oh my god, I just realized he's clumsy. <laughs> I never knew that trait about him. Uh, so the only other person left is an actor that I did get to meet when I was younger. I was like seven when I met him. So it's been about 14 years now. Uh, so I'm really looking forward to meeting him again and I need to find that picture. I just realized that oh boy. Uh well we got six and a half minutes left. Okay, why are you not doing anything? Feed bounce kuat cuddle rock. See I hate having the ghosts around because they like make it impossible to do anything um yeah so uh that's really the only stuff that um i was wondering. oh of course something huge that i'm going to go into more detail about in my speed build tomorrow my birthday was uh, just this past week on sunday and i am super ex happy that um you know it, it, the day made me super happy. Uh, I got to just sit home and relax and chat with some online friends. And then uh, for, I went out for dinner to a buffet. And the best, well, I mean, there was two things about the day that were awesome. I got a call for an interview, which I will know on Friday if I have the job or not. And then my parents actually got me my own desktop so that I don't have to worry about coming home um, every weekend to record videos for you guys. So I can now record everything up there uh, in, uh, at my uh, new place. 
because I will be moving into there next week. Oh my god, a week today I'm going to be officially moved in there. Wow. I cannot believe that. But, and I'm talking to you guys about this stuff. I'm, it's the same stuff I'm talking about for my speed build tomorrow. But, um, I don't really have that much to talk about for my, uh, see, I don't, like, I watch a whole bunch of other people do these uh, current household stuff and they never, it's never the same, like, I watch one person, they just let it record for an hour and they talk over it. And then it's just like, you know, there's a whole bunch of stuff that, you know, obviously they speed it up so it's not an hour long. And it's just, there's so many different ways people do these current household videos and I figure, you know, it's just best to, like, let it run, watch what people are doing, that kind of stuff. So, yeah, that's just, oh, um, okay, something I wanted to point out. Uh, if you're wondering about why she has some of these uh, traits, uh, she has the emotional control, responsible, and compassionate. For her, which she can't, co I might just cheat it, go into full parenting mode. Uh, one of them was have a child with three um, positive character value traits. So basically, once they aged up, they have those traits. Uh, have any household, toddler, child, or teen receive any three positive traits from character values upon aging up into a young adult. The positive traits include good manners, responsible, mediator, compassionate, or emotional control. So, uh, Roxana was the one to gain all three upon an aging up, and that's why, uh, you know, I was making sure that they got it so that she could complete the aspiration. Which you can't now, so that kind of sucks. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that's the only reason why she has those three. Um, I don't really focus on anyone else's. That's sad. But um, yeah, yeah, I think I might just like let it play. Uh, I don't really have all that much else to talk to you guys about. Uh. You know, I am enjoying this. I can't believe how far we've gotten into it. I, th I think I have a list on my phone of everyone. So I think we're in generation seven now. Oops. No, come on. <laughs> okay, so our founder was Sarah. Uh, first heir was Naomi. Second heir was Jacqueline. Third heir was Laura. Fourth heir was Atlanta. That's her. And then fifth era was Roxanne. So that's, you're on our sixth generation now. So we got four more generations to do, go. And we're actually, you know, working on generation seven at the moment. So that's actually really awesome. Well, did my game pause by itself? I wasn't really looking. I think my game does that sometimes. It honestly pauses by itself. And that scares me sometimes. Oops. Okay, so, um, oh, um, something interesting is I got my nails done for the f very first time. I went out with my sister and we got our nails done. And I'm finding it so hard to uh, do things like type, especially with the keyboard I have. Because my nails get in the way. <laughs> I've, I've tried to use the um, S uh, WASD keys with my nails. It's near impossible. Where did you go? Oh, everyone's down here now. <laughs> uh, so, uh, just, you know, trying to do that kind of stuff. It's been so hard, but, you know, I'm getting there, I'm getting there. Uh, my phone, trying to use my phone, uh, if I'm not holding it, it's hard as well. And, you know, oh, I had a can of uh, Arizona. It's the uh, Strawberry Kiwi Arizona, which is, like, my favorite right now. <laughs> I, uh, I was trying to open it, and I couldn't because I had my nails, so I actually had to get my mom to do it, which, you know, it's funny because, you know, if you ever had long nails, you understand. Uh, so it's just, oh, trying to do things yesterday was just really hard. <laughs> Uh, but, you know, I was able to get uh, stuff done, and I think, honestly, after I'm done with this video, I'm going to be looking through um, the pictures that my mom has in her room to try and find that picture I want uh, an autograph on, because that's, uh, that's a Saturday, and I don't have much time left. <laughs> but, uh, ooh, wow, seconds left. Okay.
uh, I guess I'm ending this video off here, guys. I hope you've all enjoyed this series. I This is uh, the fourth one for this, as well as there is the uh, seasons one and two that I originally did. Uh, the current household series more or less picks up right after that. Uh, I stopped doing it as an actual series because the file got corrupted, in case you were wondering. But I did pick it up once the file was fixed. I really think that's everything you guys need to know. If you do have any questions, leave it in the comments below. And other than that, I hope you have all enjoyed this video. If you have, please hit that like button, comment, and share. And if you haven't already, please hit that subscribe button and notification button to stay up to date with all the videos I post. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! I do have Snapchat and Instagram if you guys want to follow me on that.